So, you guys, there's chaos inside the train. That is big. They are fighting. <laughs> So one man paid for um, Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm TY and this is TY Vlog. So guys, welcome to the rail station. Ah. As you can see from today's title, I'm going to be taking you on a road trip from Lagos to Ibadan or your state. These two cities are within Nigeria. But first, if you are new here, do not subscribe to the channel. Please hit the red subscribe button. Actually, smash it. Yes, yes, that's it. <laughs> so I'll be sharing all about the newly built railway station the advantage and disadvantage of taking it beautiful and ugly part of my first time experiences firstly there was no option to pay online so if you if you want to even you know like book proud to visiting you cannot Although it's on the website that e, e ticket or e booking, but it's not it's not actually working yet. So the train has different plans here yeah, for first class, business class, economy, standard, and with different you can range check of online prices. for you know different range of prices. So we opted for so we are not waiting. You're welcome, standard Thank or business you. class. Business. Business okay. Yes, that will take you down. Okay. So you have to be physically present to book it, your ticket and the worst part of it is that it's strictly cash. I mean there's no there's no option for POS or any other option, it's just basically cash. Can I do this? What is this? I'm so scared of the escalator, you guys. So I didn't take it. I just, I was just like, I don't think I can do this. So I opted for the, um, what's it called? I opted for the chain. This goes to let's go to the So first you go get your ticket and then it was quite around um you know almost getting to two four so we had to really hurry up so I wasn't able to you know capture so much. So I think the uh, where we entered from was from the first class coach. You know there are different coaches. So the first class the same train, there's the first class session, there's the second um, um economy, there's the business class and standard I think. So the, the, all this work through, like you're walking through the you know coaches so you can get to your own class yeah so there are nice um you know like wardrobe session where you can just keep your stuff and yeah so yeah um there are also like 
seats the seats are numbered accordingly according to your i don't know what's called but you get to see it in this video so i earlier thought that you can sit anywhere you like but apparently you need to keep to the sitting in, um, instruction right so the seat arrangement the um, the code and numbers are written at the back of the um tickets when you get your tickets yes so and then they are labeled at the top that part where they put bags yeah there's a place for you to put your bags and other stuff luggage that you have so the seats are labeled right there so we already you know sat down well seated and then until they start announcing that oh the seat has to be show of a valid identity card each ticket has a seat number allocated to it please and head strictly to this number when on board the train Tickets are not refundable and valuable for only one journey. It is an offense to recycle the use of a ticket. You cannot upgrade yourself from a category. So we have to change and look for our seat and we found it. Yeah. So everywhere is looking neat, pump, 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 nice, nice, nice. Yeah. And it was it was cool. The good thing about of this means of transport. At this i mean right now is that the train actually leaves exactly 4 p.m there is no african time and i was so happy about that because i was still like oh even if we are late maybe you know and you, people were actually you know running to catch up so it was giving me the vibe of those american movies that we watch and then people are like oh i don't want to get late for my train and all of that so it's quite you know commendable that they actually keep to time Please be reminded that smoking or drinking of alcohol is not allowed on board. To avoid further spread of COVID-19, it is compulsory that all passengers on board wear their nose masks throughout the journey. Oh, now I see why people go to So, we moved and then, then, you know, I felt like, oh, it was quite slow until it got to, like it started slow right but then it got faster but i'm going to tell you overall summary at the end of this video so please watch to the end so it has camera also it has cctv camera it also have you know um, this television is called now so it has a display screen where you can you know maybe like watch whatever it is they are playing right there so yeah and then chairs are okay well covered because of you know maybe stains and all it has this um tabletop i don't know whatever if that's what it's called because i saw it earlier while coming in via the first coach and then i'm like oh this thing is supposed to be here but they don't serve us any drink or i don't know if they serve for staff to drink and some small chops <laughs> i don't know but yeah that's it. And the mistake I made was I didn't remember to take any snack, a lot snack, so I can just snack along. But it's fine. Oh, I'm complaining that there was no table. Like we need this. Thing. I think there's something that you pull. Oh, it first. Okay. Well, I don't know. Okay. I'm not that privilege. Okay. There. there you go. Okay, they will give us things, cappuccino, coffee, ambrosiano. <laughs> I need money. Money I need. I need. Anyway, so I can put my laptop on the table. Any? Yeah, yeah. And then it has a charging port where you could charge your, you know, gadgets and equipment. And I like this. My view. Look at my view, you guys. Journey, a journey. I'm sitting next to the window. Oh. Um, giving you airport vibes, right? <laughs> so it's it's kind of like making so much sense. Yeah, full AC. Please note that all coats are fully air conditioned. You may need to wear thick clothing to protect you from the cold. Please be informed that the items are not allowed on Lagos Ibadan train service. Oh, 
Oh, he says you got a little bit of doing this. I'm him, him, him. I'm him, him. I'm 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 him. So I got I saw one person that I know, side of like an old acquaintance of mine. I saw someone, and it was so fun. It was fun. Like have you been anywhere? Yes, yes, yes. Then so we moved. And then at some point I got bored because I was feeling like nothing is happening. Maybe they are supposed to be giving us music or something. Five, five, five. Those guys were fighting for some time. They were still with their phones. They were giving their phones. That one was coming from the group. That one is just. 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 Okay, so the same train as okay. Anyways, so I at some point I got on to editing my video. If you've not seen that video, I think it's my last video. I'm going to put it up right there for you to guys to watch. So yeah, I did that for I mean I couldn't do it for a long time because I think I wasn't really concentrating to be honest. Yeah. <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm not sure that story, but I'm going to share it one day. <laughs> you know, almost beat me. So, after that, I think I slept. Yeah. Oh, right. Before that, before then, I actually watched movies. I actually started watching movies because I was actually feeling bored. So I started watching movies on you know netflix so this movie that i'm going to do the review very soon although i'm not done watching but i will surely give you guys a review when i'm done watching it's called the smart warning woman series i think i'm sure majority of you would have probably heard, of, heard about it or not so it's on netflix it's a series and i think it's interesting because i've heard so much about it so i tried doing that but then but then i mean the network was the network was me so network was bad i mean because it was on traveling road right so i couldn't do so much with it so i ended up sleeping and then by this time you guys are seeing i woke up but then something has woke me up
So, you guys, there's chaos inside the train. That is big. They are fighting. <laughs> So one man paid for uh, So there's a man that paid So we stopped at Agege I don't know if you guys can hear me Maybe I'll just do a voice over We stopped at Agege to accommodate other passengers I think that's how they do So this man paid for business class right? And then he was saying that Nigeria allow wow He paid um, so that I hope that they sit for that business class because Nigeria like, come here with Mama so business class from my family economy. So no my so sit down my family economy. Eventually I, I guess so he came around when he came they were like there's no there's no seat. They were like there's no seat again. I said there's seat. I think so. That's what they were fighting. That's what was they were everywhere. That's what I said. Let me just see people. Bye for now. <laughs> this happened, right? Some persons get to fight. So actually, there will be like there were like um stopovers, right? Maybe at Abelkuta, at um different maybe wallet training car park. There's a name they call those places, right? You are going to see them online. You want to just brush about it. There were different stopovers where people alighted from the train and some other persons came in came inside the train. So amongst the, um, there was a particular stopover we had where um somebody came in, like some people came in the train and then that was where the issue started. <laughs> So after that, we got the point. I was pressed, so I'm like, oh, let me go and you know, use myself. Yes. I went to the restroom and as you can see this is the restroom it's looking nice so I finish and then this is the flushing 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 thing whatever <laughs> actually you guys when I actually pressed that thing I was scared like yes, yes. I'm like what's going on here this sound I was scared like I mean the train is falling here was hello I don't understand So, but then you get to wash your hands after you are done, and that's it about the restroom. I think it's pretty nice. Yeah. So, well, you guys, anyways, let me not say too much on that. <laughs> because personally, I cannot comfortably sit down on that thing and, you know, just do pass out, pass out any shit or whatever. No, I would rather just do the not the, the meaning. I can't do the major day because I, I, I don't know. I just don't know. Anyways, so you guys. It was just like, duh. Anyways. So moving on, to me it was just a pretty fight or whatever. But then you know Nigerian always in Nigeria. The Nigerian factor we shall be there one way or the other. You know, some people that are extra will always be extra. So started talking and uh, when I was in America. When I went to London, 
this apple, this, 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 blah, blah, blah. Hey guys, <laughs> so that's, that was what happened to Charo. Anyways, um, by the time we got to Ibadan, it was already like, you know, getting dark. So we got to Ibadan, I think around to 7. <laughs> It was almost like three hours, but not exactly three hours. It was like six forty something, I think. So where the train stopped in Ibadan was Monia, and that place was that Monia is quite far. It's almost like outskirts. Like I said, we are going to Oyo Oyo Road. So you guys, like, anyways, here we are in Ibadan. It was quite difficult getting, um, you know, um, transport, but then it was sorted. So, there you are. Whenever you see Mikra, just know that you are in the bottle. So, it was quite late before. Mikra, Firstly, there was no option to pay online. I mean, for people that, you know, are working class, because the, the train also has its take-up time. Um, I think on weekdays, it's usually 8 a.m. in the morning and 4 o'clock in the evening. And then for weekends, 8.30 and... and morning, and just staying calm. When we come to the right. So, that for me is a no, because I mean, Economically, it doesn't really make sense at the end of the day. So it's, it's very easy to, you know, do fraud. Convenience, like making me remember, remember BRC. The smooth ride, very smooth actually. So we hope that the management keeps, you know, doing the good, good work, which is like manage it properly Those and that needs amendments and adjustments. Hopefully, they will also be amended. Let's see you guys in my next video. Bye.